Hi, this is Jason with WP GraphQL, and today I'm going to be showing how to install the WP GraphQL plugin and the WP Graphical plugin, which provides an IDE for exploring your GraphQL schema. So here we can see I'm in a brand new WordPress install. I have exactly one post installed that came with WordPress, this Hello World post, and as you can see, I have zero plugins. So we're going to install two plugins. I'm going to click Add New and Upload Plugin and we're going to use this uploader to upload the WP GraphQL plugin. I'm going to, to do that, I need to download it. So I'm going to go to github.com slash WP dash graph QL slash WP dash graph QL. So the plugin here is hosted on GitHub. I'm going to click download. I'm going to click show in finder and then with it shown in Finder, I can upload here and click Install Now. Activate the plugin. So nothing in the admin actually changes. I don't get a new admin menu. I don't get any GraphQL settings or anything like that. Um, you see that it's active, but nothing else uh, indicates that it's changed. One thing you can do to test is open. We're going to open in a new tab. This is our site, and at the end, I'm going to put the word Graph. G-R-A-P-H-Q-L, and instead of getting a 404 page, we get a JSON payload. So this means the plugin is actually active. If I deactivate the plugin and go back to the slash GraphQL, it's just going to be a 404 page now. If I activate the plugin, now I get a JSON response. So that means our API is ready to go. So now we're going to add one more plugin, and this is a tool that is going to help us explore our GraphQL API and test it. So upload plugin. Uh, now we need to go download the other one. So instead of WP GraphQL at the end, it's WP Graph IQL. So graphical is how I pronounce it. And this is a GraphQL IDE tool uh, meant to be used with WP GraphQL. So I'm going to click download zip here. I'm going to go back to my add plugin screen, click show and finder, drag that here, click install now, and activate the plugin. So now this one actually does give us this graphical tab in our admin menu, and when we click that, we can see the graphical tool in our WordPress dashboard. To learn more about using the graphical tool, we have a video exploring the capabilities of the graphical IDE. Thank <laughs> you.